the traditional Bora dance for the Acholi people in northern Uganda. Originally, the dance was performed when a new chief was being installed at the royal function. It is also performed when a clan leader or elder dies. The Acholi found it fit to honor and pay their last respect to the deceased. Among many other Ugandan cultures, dancing around a dead body is considered taboo. And those who do this are considered to be mentally unstable or callous. However, among the Acholi, it is an honor given to a selected few lawyers and leaders. We normally dance. And we have specific dance when people are happy. Then specific dance when people are mourning or when people are sad. So in this case, in my culture, people are showing their sadness, their mourning through this song. That's why you saw when they were performing, they were not happy. They were not in the mood. On Friday, these dancers from Agago district in northern Uganda were selected to welcome the body of the former speaker, Jacob Olanya, at Entebbe International Airport. The, the traditional dance, that's how we welcome prominent people. Arubino Kidega is the head of the Acholi culture group from Agago district and he says sometimes they perform using spears. Yeah, the bola dance is a traditional dance or a roller dance in Acholi culture which started long time ago by our grandparents. It's when a big person, somebody big in the family or somebody respected, of which if they die, that's like this one of our Honorable Olanya. But for them, they all spear in annoyance to show that if we can get this real death, something called death, we can really spear it. If we can look for this death anywhere and we find it, we could really spear this death and this death will die and will stop killing our, uh, our horn or our people. During the Bora dance performance, men dress with animal skins around their waist and carry a crown of ostrich feathers on their head. Their dressing portrays their fierce warrior skills and they are generally brave people ready to attack and face their enemy regardless. The men performing this dance carry small drums in their left hands while holding small sticks they use to beat the drums to produce a very beautiful sound. During this time, women wearing brows at times a bra shake their necks and chest while moving forward and backwards. The men too perform footwork while beating their small drums and dancing to the beautiful sounds coming from the drums. The Bora dance is also reserved for political leaders, elders, religious leaders to honor and welcome them at functions. Actually, they've been doing, even for the late General Okech, they performed the dance. Uh, even our road, the, the, the second in command to His Highness Road, David Onena Chana, he passed on. Like why we did not pick Tole to welcome Olanya from the airport? Because he respected Bola so much. He loved Bola so much. That's what he treasured so much when he was still alive. <laughs> This group is expected to perform all throughout the funeral until their diseased hero is lowered to a final resting place in Lalogi Sub County in Omoro District in northern Uganda. Jingo Francis, NTV.